Hello everyone, welcome again in Engman YouTube channel. So in this video, we will continue our learning of CO2 storage modeling and simulation using CMG Gem. Okay, so it's a very, very interesting, important topic for us to learn. And CMG is a very good tool for us to simulate and to do modeling of the CCUS, especially for this case for saline aquifer. Okay, so previously we have done some editing using cedit. And now you see our file is co2injection.dat. I want to bring this file into the simulation machine. And the simulation machine for CMG in this case is gem. So I will drop and drop to the gem. Okay. And this is the submit run a simulation job. Job process settings we will use for as default for processors simulation simulator name is gem okay so we have imax gem or stars as simulator in this case for co2 storage i will use gem okay because gem is better to do co2 storage simulation compared to for example imax Simulator version is this one, priority normal, method to find executable, find exact version, and then project name, yeah, default folder. Input file, co2injection.dat. Here, output file is dot out. So later, after the simulation has been completed, and if we want to check the file, it's dot dot. co2injection.dat. And the log file is here, co2injection.log. Okay, so it's a very simple thing. We can click OK. And then we can check also the... Let's wait for a little while. Okay, so if you want to check the log, you can this one, you can do like this one. And here, ID one, project name default folder job name co2 injection dot that priority normal status is still running and then schedule local and this is the date and the file is here co2 injection dot out this is dot that this is dot out okay you can also refresh here we have our file co2injection.out. This is the size, type out file, and this is the date. Okay. You can also check the log. co2injection.log. Okay. You can expand and you see the results. 